Hi, my name is Sadie Odette. I am 26 and I am highly addicted to slapping things. I have been addicted to slapping for as long as I can remember. I was slapped when I was little and it just, I don't know, inspired me. It's hard to keep a job because I'll say, hi, do you want cash or card? It's hard to maintain friendships and keep a relationship as well because I want to go out to ice cream and slap them. And they say, why do you got to slap us? And I'll say, why do you have to be so slappable? Um, but I'm not partial to people. I'll slap anything. Bread. Eggs. Soup. Animals. Hi, Ashy. Mud, water, air, anything. I started a GoFundMe and I'm trying to get a hold of NASA because nobody has ever slapped the moon before and I want to be the first. I want to slap the moon. I am not allowed to pet sit anymore. Come here, Ashy. Come here. Come here, boy. Come here. Good boy. Good boy. Eh. Good boy, Ashy. Hi, Ashy. Eh. <laughs> it's a good boy. You keep coming back, huh? Yeah, it's a good hammy, yeah. I'm not allowed to babysit, and I can't go in public without trying to slap everyone. I currently have zero friends right now. I don't know why. I'm a good, nice person. My next item on my slap bucket list is a gorilla. I have a trip to Africa booked and I'm really hoping that the residents will allow me to, you know, slap around a gorilla a little bit.
I actually just went to Antarctica last week. I almost froze to death there, but I did get to slap a few penguins and igloos and seals. So I definitely call the trip a success. I am banned in eight countries and I'm no longer allowed in any zoos internationally. Apparently, if you sneak into the exhibit of an endangered panda bear and you slap it and its baby, you're no longer allowed in a zoo which is really unfair. I have needs. My favorite thing to slap? Probably strangers. I love how they react. <gasps> Gets me every time. I'm not even gonna eat it, I just bought it to slap. 